Hello YouTube and welcome to Groundworks Plays KSP. This is episode 2 of our playthrough. So in the previous episode we have launched our first ship and well it netted us a little bit of science and some funds. Of course science we will be using to up our research and the funds we might be using to upgrade our tracking station but not just yet because we don't have enough. However, research-wise, we could do something. We have only these basic parts. So I'm thinking I'm going to unlock basic rocketry. Yes. And engineering. I have the cash to unlock something more, though. Survivability, stability and general rocketry. Let's see if we can do survivability. I don't need it that much. Stability. Tell you what, I'm gonna keep it that per episode I can only unlock a maximum one tier. So let's say that I've unlocked this tier for this time. Let's see what wonderful missions we have. A focused observational survey report flight. I don't like those too much. Swivel Mark 16 parachute in flight over Kerbin. Well, that one we could do. Parachute will test. Flee solid rocket booster in flight over Kerbin. Mm. Swivel engine in flight. The problem with these is that you need a specific altitude. So what was the altitude here? 2 to 10 and 100 to 250. That's doable. Hammer 47 to 55. Flea 37 to 42. That one might be 9 to 16, that's doable. 80 to 190, that's also doable. Let's take the swivel test then. Perfect. Okay, so we have to figure out something. Let's just keep this contract here, shall we? 9,000, we have to have something that will bring us to 9,000 meters. So let's take it like this. Utility, that one. Science, we now have a thermometer, which we will take like at least two of. We have still the mystery goo, which I plan to in keep here backwards. And uh, what do we need? We need, we had structural coupling, we have gotten the decoupler, which is kind of nice to have. I think we're limited also with parts. Yeah, we can have 30. Well, that's not a problem. So we need to test the swivel, which we for sure will, engines. That's the swivel that we are supposed to test, perfect. And then we're going to be putting another decoupler. Like that. We can actually put them in the same stage. And then we can put one hammer. And what's our... Do we know what's our thrust to weight? No, we don't. KSpedia. Huh. 
Oh boy, this is going to be fun. I have no idea how much thrust weight I have. I'm so used on getting mods. Oh boy. I'm going to definitely put like four of these for stability and just hope for the best. Oh, this is going to be fun. Right. So, parachute going down and swivel on the way up. Let's give it a try. While we are here, might as well do this. Log temperature. I know it's not much, but it's handy. We will be putting these, pinning these experiments rather. These two, yeah. And contracts, what contracts we have. Kerbin flying 9 to 16,000. So I'm going to throttle up stability assist, but we're just going to kick the hammer. Let's hope that this will actually, and actually I'd rather have this separate. I have a feeling we're going to exceed the, the speed by a little. Okay, we are at the correct altitude, which we're going to be passing. 1680, nah, pff, no way in hell we're going to go way up. Oh well. Well. I don't know if we're high in the atmosphere. We could do the log temperature. Upper atmosphere, yes we are. Which means observe the mystery goo. Thank you. And we can always do the crew report. If nothing else, we can advance our science. So we already gotten very high, 23,000. Well, let's stage this bugger. We don't want it weighing us down. And now on the way back, there should be a way how I will test this. Now we're going to go too fast down. Maybe I ca if I can doesn't matter if I stage it. I don't know if it, if I'd make a problem if I stage it. Let's have activate the engine and then we're going to be decelerating. Run the test. Well, we tested it. Okay. That's the swivel test all right done. And two to 10,000 meters. I'm just gonna have mildly powered descent to ensure that I can test the chute. And we have tested the chute, perfect. Needed to tweak some parameters here and there, but overall, both contracts are fulfilled. Congrats. Contract complete, thank you. Another contract complete. World's first milestones, altitude of 22 kilometers. Perfect. As you can see, guys, this is proving to be quite an interesting, you know, run up. And I'm sorry I'm going to keep these episodes a little bit on the short side, but uh, the idea is here, especially in the start, to keep missions a little bit more simple, a little more, a bit more shorter. So if you're a kind of advanced type of player, I mean, yeah, well, this is beginnings, you know. I, for once, actually like and appreciate the fact that uh, these are actually quite simple and... Um, 
they grind us. It's a little bit grinding, but we give you, give us some cash, give us some, you know, uh, experience, a little bit of science points. So we will be able to research and unlock new technologies, which I think will be only fun and interesting. So 360 meters, and I have to keep reminding myself once we land, I have to rerun the experiment here because we could get additional science a little bit. So we did a crew report already. Jebediah looks happy. He's looking inside of the capsule. Come on little bit further down and we should be good to go. Where is the view? There's the view. We don't see anything. Oh well, we are coming down soon enough. There's our shadow. And there should we do. Boom, safe landing. Perfect. Now, what I want to do is EVA, take data from here, take data from here, take data from here, perfect. Can we actually take the data from the back? I'm not sure. Oh, we can take data, remove the data, perfect. And then board. And then we want to do another crew report from the Kerbin's shores. Perfect. EVA. And what we want to do also, do the EVA report. Perfect. That should bring us some science. And then we board and log the temperature. Just the right temperature for a swim. Perfect. Let's recover the vessel. That should net us a quite a handy amount of science. See, we have a total of 68 science. We have recovered the parts. And Jebediah has actually returned safely back. Perfect. And that will bring us to the end of this episode. In the next one, we will be hopefully doing unlocking a new tier and hopefully doing a little bit more complex missions now. But until then... Like if you like the episode, hit subscribe for more KSP content. Don't forget to join our Discord and support us on Patreon. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching. This is Grumforks signing off. And cut.